The top three worst snowstorms in U.S. history. Number three, the 1993 storm of the century. This massive storm stretched from Central America to Canada, forming on March 12, 1993. This storm saw not only massive snow totals, but record low temperatures and more than 315 fatalities. A region in Tennessee saw four and a half feet of snow, while one northern Georgia county totaled nearly three feet. The Florida Panhandle saw four inches combined with hurricane force winds and tornadoes. Roughly 40% of America was impacted by the storm in some fashion, and over 100 boats in the Gulf of Mexico required rescue. Number two, the Great Appalachian Storm of 1950. Heavy rain turning into snow and winds reaching up to 160 miles per hour hit the northeastern United States in November of 1950. Over 380 people were killed in this massive event that impacted 22 states. The storm set records for insurance claims for any snowstorm or hurricane at the time and caused power outages to more than 1 million people. Many record lows for November were set at this time, including 5 degrees in Birmingham, Alabama and 3 degrees in Atlanta, Georgia. Pittsburgh was covered in over 30 inches of snow, some reports in Ohio were over 40 inches, and Pickens, West Virginia recorded 57 inches. Number 1. The Great Blizzard of 1888 the Great Blizzard of 1888, also known as the Great White Hurricane, was another massive snowstorm that hit the northeastern United States as well as southern Canada. Rain turned to snow on March 12, 1888, and in some areas, winds up to 80 miles per hour came with it. Around 400 fatalities were recorded as nearly every public service was crippled for days. Snowdrifts of 30 to 40 feet were seen all across New England, with the highest being 52 feet in Brooklyn, New York. The fires that followed alone caused nearly $725 million in damage. Please like and subscribe for more.